Here we have a 69 plate Mercedes Benz GLC 220D AMG line. Now this vehicle comes with the 19 inch gloss black alloy wheels, all in excellent condition and unmarked. We do also have the obsidian black metallic paintwork. We have the LED headlights, the Pan America front grille with the big black Mercedes badge in the centre. Coming around to the passenger side, you found we have the second alloy wheel just down here, again unmarked. We do also have the side steps along the bottom, colour coded door handles and door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. Black roof rails up top along with the rear spoiler, which is sitting nice and aggressive just there. There's a look at the third alloy wheel. And then we do also have the front and rear parking sensors with a visual display and a reversing camera as well. Here's a look at the rear, you see we have the dual exit exhaust, the rear diffuser, we do also have the power operated tailgate, if you press this button here on the remote, the boot will open it just like so. Now inside of here you found we have plenty of space for whatever you may need, as you can see we've got the parcel shelf running up the top just there, storage net on the left hand side, we also have 12 volt connectivity and hooks on either side as well. Coming back out we do also have a handle on the right hand side along with a button, press the button and it closes again like so. Walking back round to the driver's side then you can see the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. And there's a look at the final alloy wheel. And we're taking a look at the interior. Inside of here you find the half leather interior, We've got the grey stitching, foldable armrest in the centre and the fixed ISO points as well. We have the AMG floor mats. We also have the vents in the centre for the rear passengers. Wooden effect trim on the doors with the integrated speakers and also electric windows. Same half leather interior at the front. With both front seats are being electrically adjustable. They're also both heated as well, controlled just there on the doors. Electric power forward and mirrors, electric windows with child lock for the rear. Automatic lights just down there. We have the multifunctional steering wheel as well. Now just take a seat inside, you find the digital screen in the centre of the dashboard. Nice little animation just there as we get it in. Put a foot on the brake, press the start button and the vehicle will turn on for us. Just turn the volume down using the steering wheel. We do have the paddle shifters either side of the steering wheel. Got the cruise control and spin to just there as well. And we are free from any warning lights on the dashboard as you can see just there. If any screens or lights are flickering, it's just the camera. They're not flickering in real life, so nothing to worry about. Now we can go through different options and different features, as you can see just there. If you press onto the home, go through and flick through all the different options using the steering wheel. We got the main screen just here in the center, which is currently showing the sat nav, but we also have many more features on there. So if you click onto the phone, then you find the phone connectivity. We do also have the other options, so we have the radio stations, we've got the media options as well. Going on to the main menu, we can scroll through other features. So we do have the Mercedes Me and also the apps just there, the internet browser. We also have the different drive modes as well. So you find Eco, Comfort, Sport, and also the individual drive mode as well. If you put the car into reverse, then you find the reversing camera with the front and rear parking sensors. We also have the wide angle and then also the parking assist. Put it back into park, moving further down again, we've got the wooden effect trim in the centre just here. We do also have the climate control with the air code air conditioning. We have some storage space inside of here with the cup holders and a 12 volt connectivity. We then have the touchpad for the screen, we have the drive mode buttons, the parking sensors, manual mode and the auto start stop button. Leather armrest in the centre which can be opened up for more storage. But that's all I'm going to show you guys today though. If you'd like to find out more, please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT, and free nationwide next day delivery. Thank you for watching. The video test drive of this Mercedes Benz GLC 220D Formatic AMG line. And the purpose of this video test drive is to show the vehicle that drives as you expect it to. As you can see, we now have to fire up the steering wheel to keep it a straight line, not being off to the left or to the right hand side, but staying straight and true. Now we do have the multifunctional steering wheel, which has the paddle shifters either side. So if you want to steer the car into manual mode, you can tap all the paddles and it will change gear. We have the volume buttons here on the left hand side, speed meter and the cruise control on the right. Digital screen in the centre of the dashboard, which can show with different displays. It's currently showing the digital speedometer. If you do listen carefully as well throughout this video test track, you'll also notice we'll be free from any unwanted knocks or bangs. 
Now we also have the half leather interior for the vehicle. Really comfortable seats and also electrically adjustable. Easily do two or three or even 400 miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. Both front seats are also heated, which is perfect for them cold winter mornings. We have many more features as well on the interior of this vehicle. The wooden effect trim running across the doors and also in the centre here. Really makes it a nice place to be. We've got the main infotainment screen just here in the centre, currently showing the sat nav, but also has many more features you would have seen on the photos. Below there, we do have the dual zone climate control with the ice squad air conditioning, perfect for them hot summer days. We also have the automatic gearbox as well with all the different drive modes. Now we are about to take a right hand turn to put our right indicator on. We'll start to slow down and wait for this van to go past before making the right hand turn onto the industrial park. And I will perform an emergency stop in three two and one hard onto the brakes put the car into reverse reverse camera appears on the screen put it back into a drive now with no issues whatsoever and if this video hasn't answered all your questions then please feel free to get in contact with our sales team where they can answer all and answer questions along with running for some inquiries of you that's all for me today though cheers